We'd like to welcome you to the opening reception of our Summer Seminar 2015. Uh, my name is Randall Martin from the BC Council for International Education. We're gathered here in Whistler, home of the 2010 Olympics. We're very fortunate tonight to be joined by the member of the legislature. Well, thank you very much. I'm here on behalf of Minister Andrew Wilkinson and the Government of British Columbia. It is very interesting to discuss, uh, together with sister organizations, what are the challenges, the trends, the developments, and the issues at stake in, in higher education at large, but more particularly in international education. My job at the Canadian Embassy in Beijing is to help Canadian education institutions to promote themselves in China. And share with them what BC has done in terms of uh, many aspects of international education, whether it be student mobility incoming, even outgoing. The, the simple idea that all BC institutions have stood up and taken notice of the India growth story and they, they have felt that uh, India is the place they need to be to recruit more international students. I am here to discuss and to show to the people that we can develop uh, very uh, strong relations between Brazilian and Canadian universities. And most critically, bettering our communities and our world by extending global learning opportunities to underserved populations. This year we're sponsoring the mentorship program. Whether you're a mentee or a mentor, to get involved. So I strongly believe that it's rewarding for both participants. There's no such thing as qualified or not. Uh, all of our life and professional experiences, to me, are valuable. Everybody has something of value to share, to contribute. BCCIE does a fantastic job representing the interests of the post-secondary education on international fronts. So by partnering with BCCIE for Summer Seminar, it gives me an opportunity to meet with colleagues uh, from across Canada, but primarily within BC, um, and of course to be able to connect with other associations and government bodies. We have a capacity of over 1,200 to 1,300 students every year, and out of that, 53% currently are international students. Any BC institution which is into the business of education has to be here because the uh, discussions, the panel discussions, the concurrent sessions are so relevant. The programs they put on are phenomenal. The support that they give, not just at the summer seminar, but year-round, is fantastic for really advancing British Columbia's educational goals on an international basis. It is getting better by the minute. The, the more people I talk to, the more sessions I attend. Thoughts on the theme of global responsibility. Important. Timely. And it all starts with education. The issues that we have to solve are bigger than just one country. And through education is the only way that we will create leaders for our future. My passion for teaching and learning with so many people in so many countries. Education is the route to the future. I can no longer imagine my life without having had those experiences, without having been exposed to the wonder of culture. Um, it would be like trying to imagine a life without oxygen. We're asking what kind of world do we want to live in. Global leadership is something which the world really needs at this moment. 